Let me check my fish if my fish is ready. Just check a look. Isn't it yummy? <laughs> channel so today's video is gonna be cook with me so i want to cook porridge butternut squash with irish potatoes you know just a very delicious one porridge so back home back home we normally cook um butternut squash that's annual with yam but here I can't get yam, so in place of yam, I'm gonna be using Irish potato in place of yam. So I have my ingredients here. I've not prepared my ingredients, so I'm gonna prepare that. I have my I have my crayfish here. I have let me show you guys. So here I have um kale. I'm here to wash and cut the tail and there is my butternut squash I preserved it inside the freezer so I'm going to be using it and here is my onions I'm here to cut it I have the um, tomatoes here here is my Irish potatoes then here I have I have them um, salt pepper and seasoning powder so I'm going to be going to be using a um, smoked mackerel fish my smoked mackerel fish is not yet ready, it's still in the oven. If you want to know how to smoke fish, mackerel fish, I'm going to leave the link in the description box how to smoke your mackerel fish. So, let's get started. Bye. I've missed this, um, this combination. I've missed it so much. <laughs> Anu and the porridge yam. And the yam porridge. Oh. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to finish this. I can't wait to finish this cooking. Let me check my fish if my fish is ready. Ooh, you see that smoke? <laughs> Mommy. But before I continue, let me soak. My my granite. So I bought I bought granite a few days ago. Yes. How to roast peanuts in the oven? I'm going to leave the link in the description box on how to roast your peanut in the oven. So let me soak this before I start. I'll add my hot water here. I'm gonna cut these onions and these tomatoes. I'm going to fry it first before I will start adding other ingredients. Have you tried butternut squash meat? Yeah! With yam before? Yeah! Yeah! If you are in a place here, you can get yam. Yeah! You can combine it with yam. Yeah! But if you cannot get yam, yeah. try it with Irish potatoes. Yeah. I haven't tried it with Irish potatoes, but back home I've tried it with yam. Yeah. So, these are... Uh, 
let me say, this is my first time of trying it out with Irish potato. So we are doing it together. Let's see how the final result is going to be like. So we are all doing this together. My pot has dried. I'm going to add oil. Okay. Oil, oil. Actually, back home, if we are cooking porridge, you have, we use palm oil, but I'm going to be using vegetable oil. I'm going to be using olive oil here. So, what else? I'm going to fry this now. So, I'm going to fry, I'm going to fry this. I'm going to fry tomatoes and onions now. So this is what I'm frying now. So now I'm going to reduce the size of these potatoes. It's quite big. So I'm going to reduce it. Maybe I might cut these three. Yeah, three. One, two. This is the size I cut this. So I'm going to do same to this other one. One. I'm gonna be cooking the potato first. Then later I'll add my butternut squash. So let me put this inside my pot. Crayfish. Let me quickly blend this crayfish now. So, I've blended my crayfish. I'm gonna add this crayfish now. Yeah. Add the crayfish. Yeah. Yeah. Crayfish. So I'm really trapped. So I'm gonna rinse this. I'm gonna rinse this mine my blender to get the trapped ones out because you know we african we africans we don't waste we don't waste anyhow we make sure that we get everything okay mm -hmm. so. The next I'm gonna be adding is my smoked fish. I will put the link on how I smoked this fish in the description box. So two videos to check out in the description box. One is a peanut I soaked earlier, and this one is a um, smoked mackerel fish. So I'm gonna add it here. So that we get that smoky. So that we get that smoky flavor. You know that smoky flavor. It tastes so good. So next I'm gonna be adding here is my spice, salt and pepper. So I'm gonna stir. I'm gonna stir and allow it to cook. Once it's cooked to a point, I will add my butternut squash. So now the potato has boiled to an extent. It's time for me to add butternut squash. So let me show you guys how it is. So look at it. Look at it. The aroma that is dozing out of this my pot. So here comes in my butternut squash. This is gonna be a very sweet meal. So what I'm gonna do now is to get my vegetable ready. So 
I'm going to cover and allow it to cool. Add the veggies. Invited to come and join us. So, thank you so much for cooking with me. See you on my next video. Bye. Bye.